You guys know what time it is. Honest review of Pexta. Let's see how it stacks up with the other big boys. Let's check it out. Welcome back, Dropouts fans. Thank you so much for tuning back into my channel. And if you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Matthew, and I make daily Shopify videos to give you guys course level content for absolutely free. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, hit that like button, and definitely go ahead and leave me a comment. Because if you do those three things, you also enter to win a chance to win a 15 minute one on one consulting call with me, which I give away every single video. So if you skip through the intro of this video, don't because that's where I announce the winners. Anyway, guys, enough of that stuff. Let's jump into what we're talking about this video. So I've been getting a lot of comments recently asking me about Pexta. So Pexta's had a few updates recently. I'm going to go check them out and see how they compare because I've been testing so many new product research tools for you guys that now I got to check out Pexta, see how they're stacking up with the other boys in the market. So let's check it out. Let's hop onto my computer and see how they're doing. Let's do it. All right, guys. So we are on Pexta right now. So basically, let me show you guys the pricing really quick. So we see, you know, just how much it stacks up. And right now, if you go click on the link below, you get 50% off Pexta. And on top of that, I'm going to give you guys a discount code which you can use to get 30% off on top of that so you'll actually only be paying 20 bucks a month on uh, 19.96 to be precise so that is a pretty good deal premium right I mean, obviously you can get the standard but really not that worth it uh, you don't really get too many things with standard but premium is pretty awesome so let's go check out what it actually does and by the way ultimate is ridiculous you don't really get anything new other than access to special products which I haven't tested yet so I don't actually know but in my opinion hundred dollars a month for the amount of products that you get with ultimate is not really worth it all right guys so i'm, I'm pretty familiar with pexta this is not my first time using it so let's go jump into the product section and uh, i'll show you guys around so right here is a perfect example this is going to be a ultimate product and okay so this one actually looks pretty good it has 2000 2633 orders and we can't see it because it's only for ultimate users but what we can see are these premium products so here's a cool one a mobile gaming controller but as you can see the thing is is it only has 139 orders but this might be such a new product so we can go check that out luckily for us but what we get on this product page is pretty interested interesting so we get how much they recommend selling it for what kind of profits you'll be expecting your cost for acquisition and obviously these are pretty rough guesses and with any of these product research tools they're always giving you these rough guesses so they're not necessarily super accurate so don't expect to always get these kind of numbers this is like if you're running a really good ad I mean you know it's actually not bad seven but it's a seven times ROA so it's it's kind of out there but hey, if you can really optimize your ads, you can definitely achieve that. I'm not saying it's not achievable, but I'm just saying, you know, don't necessarily just look at that CPA. So they give you a nice little blurb here that you can put on your website. So it makes it a lot easier to write that intro sentence. And like I've shown you guys in other videos, you can always just go on Amazon, find similar products. That works really well. Now here, again, just like Niche Scraper, just like Ecom Hunt, you get the exact same thing here. So we get the store selling it, the Amazon and the eBay page. So if I go ahead and open up the store selling it, we can go and actually look at how they've designed it. You know, so I don't know what currency this is. They do not have a good currency converter. Cool product page. Is this Philippine dollars? Okay, maybe. But anyway, this is pretty cool, right? It might be really hip right now, especially with the whole buzz around Battleground. What's it called? Battle. Oh, PUBG. So PUBG is pretty popular now. So let's go hit on the product link and see how recent these orders are coming in and whether or not this is actually a new or old product. So it only has 31 reviews. So that's actually going to tell us that it's pretty recent. So let's check out how many orders are coming in through Overload because obviously we can go to the bottom and go see how recent the orders are. Actually, let me just click on this. I'll show you guys. We can click right here and we can see the orders. And as you guys can see what is this november not too many orders with this product right maybe four or five a day and these are just the ones right through aliexpress so this might just be people who are not that stupid and are not not stupid but who are not buying off of shopify but instead are just going directly to the manufacturer they understand aliexpress so let's go see how it looks on the product list and this is just what i would do with any products that i find on pexa so i didn't choose this one for any reason i mean it did kind of stick out to me because of PUBG, right i know that's very popular so two orders on overlow not that crazy only 17 imports zero page views so people aren't even advertising it maybe my vendor or vendor are using are using a different fulfillment app so there are other apps so obviously there's like zero up stuff like that that are not going to show up in overload stats but uh zero is pretty sketchy to me so this wouldn't be a product i would try if i'm new to shopify like i said before we're looking for products that are actually hot selling already we don't want to reinvent the wheel all right so that is some cool stuff that you get with pex that, that you get with all the other product research tools so this right now is not looking much different than most product research tools we also get the post link uh, that was posted on september 18th so let's go look at that let's just go look at their facebook ad i'll show you guys how to use it so again this is the vendor philippines one so they have a 
decent amount of engagement. How long have they been? Oh, a month ago and 973k views. Whoa. Okay. 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 There might be something that I have not done properly. So I trusted their link for AliExpress where it could actually be a different one. So let's go actually PUBG mobile. Let's just write that. Let's go see what pops up. This is turning into a bit of a product research video, which I didn't want it to, but okay. 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 This changes a lot. So this product I think is the exact same if I'm not mistaken. Wait, let me just go check it out. Okay. So let's go try to find this squad. Huh? We got the idea of the product. So let's go open the import list and see how this one is doing because 970 K views in a month definitely tells me that this product is doing well. Okay. So 212 orders in the last 30 days is not bad. And this is not the exact product that they have listed there. It's actually kind of cool. I mean, if you're gaming on your phone, that's kind of weird, but kids these days are in that stuff. Anyway, so obviously this is a, a pretty decent product and it's not necessarily the first one that we should look at. Maybe the second one with 3000 review, uh, 3000 orders is actually doing better now because it's slightly cheaper. All right, guys, I'm sorry. I just found a pretty interesting product that I thought, you know, might be actually pretty decent, but screw that. I for totally forgot that I'm doing a review of Pexta, not doing product research. So I'm probably going to cut that part and uh, you guys can take a look at this stuff anyway. I was just showing you guys how I would use Pexta. And as you can see, it's just so intuitive for me. I can't even help myself. I just start doing product research. But anyway, so what else do we get on the site is we get the targeting, we get attachments, we get ideas for targeting. So here we have strong flex targeting where I prefer single interest. I'd, I'd literally write something like just like GameSpot or I'd write or GameSpot. Okay, sure, I'd write GameSpot, IGN, you know, uh, EB Games, like you, whatever, you name it, or Players Unknown and Fortnite. I'd split test those two and just throw out this ad because this is actually a pretty cool product. And if they're running it like that for that long, this is definitely a pretty popular product. But the fact that it's only in the Philippines kind of sketches me out. I don't know what 2000. So it's pretty, <laughs> it's pretty cool. And we get three options for targeting. And do they actually link us with the video? Mm, no, not in this one. Oh, that's kind of sad. Usually they give you the video links, but not in this one. We can always just download the post from Facebook. We can just download it right from Facebook. It's very easy. Uh, Pex actually offers you a lot, uh, very similar to what Niche Scraper and all those other apps use. So I'm not a hundred percent sure if it's super worth it now one person brought up the fact that you get multiple videos from niche scraper and that's definitely true so that's something to consider so let's maybe click on let me try to find something that has a lot of orders okay so this one says 749 orders let's go check out this one so apparently untapped on Facebook, lip pumping serum. Serum. Do we have any videos? Okay, there we go. So here, as you can see, we have a couple of options for videos, which we can mix and match. So we can use some of this one, use some of that one, and kind of create like a new ad. So that's kind of interesting. That's what. That's probably the one thing that separates them. And I'm not, like the last thing is just that they offer you three things. So in my opinion, this app stacks up pretty nicely with the other boys. Uh, it's nowhere near Seller Pulse. So Seller Pulse, I would say, is kind of a different app in general. So it works differently. Whereas this just gives you uh, Seller Pulse kind of puts the power into your hand so it's different uh this is well priced it's decently priced niche scraper you can get uh ten dollars a month for your first month this is going to be 19. i don't know if this is much better it's totally up to you guys honestly ecom hunt niche scraper they're all on the same level i don't see a huge difference between them personal preference i can't say much or different like there's too much different between all these boys i see the same products everywhere so uh, I, don't, I don't know if they're in like cahoots with each other but it is what it is guys i hope you enjoyed the video that's gonna do it for it so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i hope you guys enjoyed this review in all honesty it's good it's really good all these apps are great uh, i'm not gonna say one is better than another other than seller pulse it's just different seller pulse is a different app it's more like jungle scout whereas these ones are just like feeding you stuff seller pulse is for you to look through so it's up to you whether you guys get this i'm not going to try to convince you guys to do it or not you guys saw the power of it. you guys saw how i use it and in my opinion it's just as good as the others uh niche scraper offers a few different options so you can actually look through websites and you can search at products and they'll show you you can search in a few different ways you can search through website you can search through products and you can search through uh the products that they offer so it's hard to hard to say i think i'm going to stick with niche scraper on this one but if you guys decide to get pexa it's totally up to you it's a great product and i was i mean this is a, it's a great product research tool and before i figured out about all the other ones i was using it for a long time so you're definitely not stupid if you're getting this it's cool and that's it guys i hope you enjoyed the video more content tomorrow stick around because i'll be announcing the winner from today's video don't forget to comment i'll see you guys tomorrow peace